and welcome back to Dugas Coffee TV, reporting here today from the Financial Partners Expo in Amsterdam. Joining me next in the studio is Christoph Cohan of High Sky Brokers. Christoph, thank you very much for coming in today. Thank you. So, what did you come to Amsterdam today to achieve for your business? Well, the main goal is just to meet the new people and uh, learn about the new trends, uh, just see what, how it's going with the old industry and maybe get new some contacts. Uh, <clears throat> meet the old friends and, and basically not do the some net networking and just just find solutions that will be let's say good for our clients for the upcoming year. How important then do you think the affiliate sector is to the FX industry? I would say it is important but <clears throat> I think the, the most problematic and important part for the clients in all this industry I think is education and uh, Affiliate programs are important but uh, basically the forex markets uh, in my opinion, it requires a bit more time for the clients to, 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 to prepare and uh, basically the affiliate programs uh, are important, but as long as they do not provide enough education, you know, it's still maybe uh, something missing for, uh, let's say, the, every Forex broker, if, if he uses the, just the, the simple affiliate programs that uh, are supposed to automatically convert. So I'm a bit reluctant in terms of, let's say, how efficient it can be in terms of achieving the long-term cooperation with any single client, but uh, I think this, this trend will be growing and uh, basically the, the programs will be more and more important in the future. Walk us through then some of the key trends that you've seen in the FX industry during the last year. I would say like this, no, like everyone would <laughs> say, no, mobile trading, social trading, no. For me, I, I see it in general as, a, let's say, bringing the market closer to the people. So, mobile markets or mobile trading means, in fact, uh, the thing that you can in every place you can just check how the market is going. You can do transaction anywhere. The social trading. Uh, saves a lot of time of thinking about the transactions because you just follow the, the trend which is convenient for some of the people it doesn't necessarily solve the problems but i think the general tendency is to bring the market closer to the people and i think uh, this will continue in the coming years in the industry as well how crucial then would you say the affiliate sector is to your business now, to my business I would say like this, that this is just a part of what we are doing and uh, we basically, mostly based on the online marketing that we do within our own, let's say, resources. Uh, there is certainly a lot of, uh, let's say, possibilities and uh, space to grow in that sector, but uh, our core interest uh, so far has been on the online marketing with it, uh, let's say, in-house. But of course we are, let's say, open for, for new projects and uh, we would like to see this this part of the our company also growing. We've touched already on social trading. You also touched on uh, mobile devices. Uh, what do you see as being next in this space, and how will you be looking to to touch that? I would say this that I don't expect any revolution in let's say one or two years because I think that there is a lot of things happening. But it's in fact it's the client who decides what is really revolution or not. And part of that buzz for me is, is done by just the software and IT developers that are just targeting the brokers to offer them new solutions. Some of them are good for the client. Some of them are just kind of let's say niche part. But uh, what I expect is that everyone who can. Uh, make the next step in making the markets uh, easier, let's say, to, to, to start with uh, for the clients will be, uh, let's say, uh, entering this new years as some kind of small potential leader. So I think it's all about uh, how close you are to the client and how quickly you can show what are the markets around for the new people <coughs> and those that just learn that it exists, but you still need to catch their attention and, and show them that this is something that uh, they can uh, Treat as a fund, treat as investment, <laughs> treat as a, some kind of emotional play. Uh, the choices of the, on the client, but uh, the main target is just to overcome the barrier of the client not having enough time to do something. And I think this is the main problem with the whole industry is fighting that everyone is fighting for the attention of the client. And uh, if you are not flashy enough or quick enough or easy enough, then you are behind the, the others that, that, that still may be uh, competing for that time. And you are not competing only with the forex industry, but you are in fact competing with everyone else who is just trying to get in, into the client's head and, and get their attention. Christoph, thank you so much for coming in and chatting with us. And viewers, thank you very much for joining us here at the Financial Partners Expo in Amsterdam. Goodbye for now.